everybody out there, this is Popular Stranger and we are back at you again today with another Madden 24 Ultimate Team video. We got part four of the Red Zone Rail promo. It's live right now in today's video. We're gonna go over the entire promo, including how you can finally redeem your free 99 overall rookie premiere. Let's go ahead and jump right on into it. So we got brand new solo challenges. We got new field pass objectives. We got brand new cards. And if you are ready to be done with Madden 24 Ultimate Team, today is finally the day. So if you go into the Rookie Revolution, section of solo challenges we've been getting things added on to this and this is a five-part promo so today's part four the final installment will be next week but you don't really need to wait for that content to redeem anything that you can get for free with one small exception but if you take a look at the milestone rewards here there's four different sequences of solos each sequence has 50 stars four times 50 is 200 i knew that because i'm good at math and if you take a look at those milestone rewards you can go all the way up to 200 stars, which finally means not only can you get your second rookie premiere token from the solos, but you also get to unlock another golden ticket BND fantasy pack. So if you max out every single star on all of the available solos, you get the rookie premiere token at tier nine, the golden ticket fantasy pack at tier 10, and you should have already received back at tier six, another rookie premiere token. So you need four of these to trade in for a free rookie premiere of your choice. Two of them are going to be from the solo challenges. The other two will be found in the rookie premier field pass and just like parts one two and three we now have more objectives to earn more xp within this field pass you can see there's three different uh, se sections right here within week number four to earn xp i went through and added up everything and at this very moment there should be a total of 63,000 xp that is potentially able to be earned which means back at level nine you got your rookie premier token uh first one in the field pass the second one can be unlocked at level 19, which requires 51,000 and a half XP. So there is enough XP in the game to unlock this. So again, you now have all four rookie premier tokens, two from solos, two from the field pass, in which you can trade these in as of today to redeem that free 99 overall rookie premier card. There's also enough XP in the game to reach level 21, which gives you another golden ticket fantasy pack. 61,000 XP is going to be required there. You can't fully max it out. You're going to have to wait until next week. But overall, generally speaking, the best rewards, the two golden tickets in this field pass, one golden ticket in the solos, and then all four of the rookie premier tokens, two from solos, two from the field pass, is all achievable as of today. Once you earn those four tokens, you're going to head on over to item sets. You're going to place them into this 99 overall B&D rookie premier token fantasy exchange set. This will let you pick any one of the 10 available 99 overall rookie premier cards. You're going to get a 99 overall in this year's game. This is also going to give you a pack when you load up Madden 25 Ultimate Team that lets you reselect any one of those 10 players at a much lower overall. I'm guessing probably 86, 87 overall, but this will give you one of three potential rookie premier cards moving on to Madden 25. The other two have to be done via sets, and those sets are going to require four 99 overall Red Zone Royale champions. Now, the good news is, as of last week, if you go back and look at the field pass objectives, completing this set and completing the second set, uh, both of these basically gives you back a fantasy pack, and that fantasy pack lets you pick four of the 99 overall Red Zone Royale players to receive back as BND plus your 99 overall rookie premier player. So if you're still playing the game, especially competitively, completing these sets is giving you back 499s, technically 599. So it makes it much easier to continue to keep your team so you can go out there and continue to win games. So we have a new LTD in Ladanian Tomlinson. You can see he's going to come with a baked on energizer, rack him up and evasive. At this point, the attributes on all of these cards are going to be really, really good. And he does get access to charge up X factor which means you can get angry runs on him for the majority of the game for one AP. The three other discounted abilities don't take up all of these other discounted buckets. And I'm pretty sure if I remember correctly here, been playing a lot of college football lately. Uh, all of these buckets also have a ton of zero AP discount. So basically this is almost a carbon copy of the Jameer Gibbs with the exception of a few abilities, but you know, the, it's the same in, in the sense that you get all of those discounted buckets available within both players. Now, 
we also have two champions that came out today. The first one's going to be Marquise Pouncey. If you're tired of going against the Vanguard meta, you're going to have to deal with it even more with this card. If you're running the Vanguard meta, well, this is a must-have card. He comes with Secure Protector and Vanguard baked in. No X-Factors because he's an offensive lineman. But again, if you scroll back here, with the exception of uh, some of these abilities like Threat Detector and Secure Protector, which is already baked on for zero, uh, you get a bunch of different options here for zero AP abilities on this card. The other set Red Zone Royale card is going to be Darren Woodson, strong safety, solid attributes, six foot one. I think with the abilities that are baked on here, he's he's better suited as a sub linebacker because of the avalanche. You get the uh, reinforcement in there baked on as well, uh, and he does get a charge up universal coverage. So if you want to play him in coverage, you can go ahead and use this. It's just going to take up one of the three X factor slots on your defensive side of the ball. And again, he gets access to all of the uh, potential zero AP ability buckets here. So you should be able to get things like deep out zone KO, deep zone KO, tackle supreme, pretty much anything you want, you typically are going to be able to get on this card. And again, with that charge up X factor, you also get universal coverage. So this is a really good card and it's going to be hybrid where you can play it as a high safety and coverage or a sub linebacker if you want to let the AI control him or you want to control him yourself. And of course, to get the non-LTD 99 overall cards, the requirements are going to be four, I'm sorry, six 97 overall Red Zone Royale cards. Last week, we put out a method on the different various ways that you can go about trying to complete these sets. I would say for the most part, all of that stuff is still going to stand true today. So if you want to go watch that video, we'll link it down below in the comment section as a pinned comment. But I went through basically all of the different ways to acquire either pieces or or 97 overall Red Zone Royale cards to roll your way up to those 97s uh, by acquiring lower overall cards as the pieces to eventually build these 99s to then eventually get your, your rookie premier card sets done. You also have your free welcome pack player for week four of this promo, which is Rob Gronkowski yet again. Uh, this time around, we have a quarterback item, and I believe they said that they were going to make him seven foot 11 so he's six six but when you put him in your lineup i believe he's going to go up in height he's also going to go up to a 99 overall you can see all of the baked on abilities that they gave him according to mutt.gg they also gave him a traditional four release so this is a great opportunity if you're trying to get done with everything to sell whatever quarterback you might have and use this card free for the next week the running back gronk from last week went down to a 90 overall in a week from today this card will get nerfed down to a 90 overall and we'll get one final gronk out of position or they could throw us off and just finally give us a tight end gronk card we'll have to see about that uh store offers listen i wouldn't be spending any money on this game but we'll go ahead and show you the pack offers here basically they're saying if you got a hundred dollars to spend you can get a rookie premiere set done uh that's exactly what this will give you it basically gives you 4.99 overalls you put them into the set remember in return you would get that 99 overall rookie premiere plus four bnd 99 overall red zone royale cards back so if you want to take the the i can call it the cheap way out because it's hundred dollars but if you don't want to spend time and you're okay with spending money that bundle is available i would say just grind the game if you're still playing the game and not playing college football you got the same 25 dollars bundle that's been coming out every week and i don't know if this is an old true champion pack or a new one because i haven't really been touching the game lately uh, but those are going to be your pack offers so in summary if you've been grinding for the free rookie premiere there's enough of everything to get it now and if you're ready to move on from that in 24 all ultimate team today or this weekend is definitely your best opportunity now that the majority of the stuff that you can earn is all available to you thank you guys for watching another video my name is popular stranger i'm out peace